YouTube land, what's good? It's your boy B Heard, aka Brian, aka Prince, aka Prince Vegeta about the hating. Uh, if you don't know me, future FGC commentator here. Um, if you're seeing this screen, hearing this voice, you're in the right place. This is the Road to Evil series where I practice my commentary over your matches. You know, top players, people I respect, and the viewers. Anyone that supports me, leave your CF fan down below and I'll commentate your matches. Today, we got a special guest on the thing. And actually, the one thing that's interesting about the special guest is uh, I've, I would say I've been committed to the FGC for at least over well over a year now, right? And this guy I found through Twitter and like his Twitter, his Twitch clips and highlights and stuff he does, obviously high fighting and things of that nature. Automatic himself, Mr. Automatic. I don't know why I said it twice like that, but we're going to let it slide. Uh, beast of a Cody player. Kind of wants to get some Cody footage, but this is a guy uh, just as good. So I don't think you got Scott footage. You might as well get the Scott footage, right? Um, I'm excited to see him play. Like big fan, big fan. He kind of stops through the R, uh, the Reddit fighting weekly online tournament. I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> Thinking out loud, but yeah, he stops by. Uh, huge supporter. I think he actually has some players that's in his dojo that actually plays a lot. I can't. I want to. Is it Zonk Knuckle? I can't remember off the top of my head. I think it is. But uh, yeah. So let's get into Mr. Automatic, some of his matches, and watch him play and commentate the damn thing. I'm excited. And uh, yeah. Hopefully, I do good to the standards of his teaching because I think he actually has like a Cody breakdown. I don't know if. I think he's, he worked on a Sagat breakdown as well, too. He's a really smart player. I think he plays on Hitbox. Uh, yeah. I enjoy the stream, too. Going against Miori. I definitely didn't look that up. So if anyone tells you that I looked that up before, uh, they're lying. Going with V-Trigger 2 here, too. Interesting, interesting. Uh, he could guard break. And some of those V-Trigger moves, man. Those are going to be some powerful moves. Oh. <sighs> Man, Sagat looks sick in this game. I would not mind playing Sagat. Jerry, too. Jerry, you know, Jerry, I feel like, has been the most slept on character this season because Jerry is really strong. I mean, obviously, it takes the right person to have the control in the hand when they're playing Jerry, as Jerry, but still, nonetheless. Light kick store. Oh, shot the fireball, but the good jumping by uh, Automatic. Okay, pinwheel. And then the store, too. The store is minus uh, two on block, so you could get it right there. That's very nice. We're out of there. Got the knee. Oh, okay. EX pin will. Only. Oh, caught him low with the V trigger too. Oh, did the knee. Oh, got the guard. I mean, I mean, honestly, you would take the guard break because it scales like crazy once you take the guard break. So that's not the end of the world. Low tiger shot. Oh, but the armor. It doesn't matter if you activate. <laughs> Automatic. Okay. Oh my goodness. Back at it. Crush counter to start off the round. Oh, it was a little too far, maybe? I was going to say, I wonder if you got more. Because he got two hits on it. But Yo, good uppercut. That's going to hurt. That's going to hurt a lot. Uh, Just went for positioning there. Miori did. I'm not mad at it. Thought he was going to get more damage. But yeah, if you could put him in your opponent in the corner, why not? Especially in a game like Street Fighter V. Uh, yo, the cancel into the light kick release. Activates into a DP. Ew, that looked like it hurt. That match was so damn fast. I didn't feel like I ain't saying nothing smart. <laughs> felt like I was just a reaction channel right there. I apologize. <laughs> uh, damn. The automatic. I, the name speaks for itself, people. If you don't believe me, go watch his content. Please. <laughs> Oh my goodness. A name speaks for itself. Let's see how matchup two goes. I think it's Miori again. Uh, automatic really just bullied, to be honest with you. Uh, <laughs> just felt like the pressure was good. We, I feel like we played the majority of that match in the corner. The DPs were on point. The, the knees to keep uh, Miori in the corner was on point. Just a sharp game as ever. 
and back into it. Let's get into it. The jump in to no avail, get DP'd. Got the sweep there, and they got the store. Ah, oh, but landed on the fireball when you try to jump back. Don't interrupt with a button when you know he got the knee. Knees to the face. How you feel? Hmm. Huh. Committed there with the back hard kick. Okay. Jump in on that side. You don't want to be in that corner. I understand it. Light kick. So, oh, that light kick release, though. The combo off the fireball like that. Into an uppercut. Oh, the bait. He's about to get a stun and got it. Just barely got it, but got the stun nonetheless. And Miori taking round number one. Off to a better start than last game, that is for sure. Let's see what kind of adjustments that uh, Automatic can make. Try to get it with that forward medium kick. Oh, good combo to the, uh, the knee. And finish it off with the knee. Okay. Oh my goodness. Uppercut again. Stop it. Stop it. Perfecto. And then to just walk out of that range slightly and then hit him low. To like the, <laughs> it was a bait that didn't even go away. Like, oh man. The skills are automatic. You confirm it to like EXP and well. I like it. Crash counter. This is a good follow up. Good damage from Yari too. Try to bait here. Light kick store minus two. I like the challenge by uh automatic. Had no choice. Had to get out of the corner. Uh, other side, nice blocking. Uppercut. <laughs> the uppercut's always gonna work, baby. And again. Oh, do you see them kicks of fire? Oh, all oh, that armor. I th thought you only had one hit of armor, but it seemed like the guy got more than that. I might have to look up the uh, frame data on that. And again, so much armor in the cancellation. It's a super. Uh, huh, huh, huh. Huh, light your chest up. You know, with that super, I don't mean to talk about Jerry's chest, but you would figure that her chest would have a scar on it, kind of like Sagat's chest with Ryu. No, uh, uh, come on, man, he, he lit the chest on fire. I just, I don't know. Maybe because he didn't have the evil energy in him. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that in this video. <laughs> I don't want to piss off Street Fighter fans more than I already do sometimes. <laughs> Mm. Final game, final round. Final game, final set. Let's get into it for Mr. Automatic. Hopefully you're enjoying the content. If you are, be sure to leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you're over me, commentate your matches, leave your CFN down below. And yeah, yeah. Let's talk about the last matchup. Versus Laura. Will the zapping happen? Or the fireball happen? We sell sheet. Clumsy. I feel like nothing will be clumsy about his gameplay at all. Yo, to duck the high tiger shot. Well, I mean, obviously, it's a high tiger shot. Just answer my own question. Low tiger shot's good, too. But uh, I think from the demonstration, it says it just has a little bit more startup, but it's powerful. Like, you can leave your opponents at bay, too. And, you know, uh, most people like to block low and then just react to the overhead. So, it works out. V-Skill. Oh. I like the idea by automatic to try to punish that, but it was just a little too far. This pressure, though. Oh my goodness. Sagat just overwhelming you. And Sagat's. Oh. He tried to go in. What is that called? The elbow, too? And the elbow didn't work in his favor at all. Yeah, just elbow. Mm. That's unfortunate. For baby girl. Excuse me, I was looking away. Good interrupt of the fireball. No thunderclap for you for clumsy. Oh, and again. Caught the dashing. EX Tiger uppercut. Oh, stay in the corner. This pressure is real. <sighs> he missed a heavy version. He got stunned for it. And in the car. Uh, yeah, the V skill. Let's add more damage to it. Why not? Automatic. I do apologize for looking away for a second round, but damn automatic 
living up to the name. Like I said, another person that supports the RSF Street Fighter. So, big fan, big fan. Hopefully, you go support that man. Go tell him BR sent you. If you ever want to be a part of a live, touch that TV slash press BR2. If you ever want me to compensate your matches, leave your CFN down below. Uh, be sure to like, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm out. Till next time. Peace.